We are in Alliance, Nebraska, and we are on one of our three areas that we farm. I always worked with my dad. I love farming, that's all I ever wanted to do. We worked together until 2002 when he passed away suddenly. I remember a lot of people saying, well, there goes the farm. So I felt a, a really big burden to try to carry on the tradition and had no idea about the financial decisions or even how to make a budget or anything like that. There was a lot to learn in a short amount of time. It wasn't a guarantee we'd get renewed again with somebody with no experience. The bank took a chance on me. It's, it's worked out fortunately. Neil and I have known each other pretty much our whole lives. I've known Mark since been five years old. Went to country school together. I was a grade ahead of him, so I was in first grade. He was a kindergartner. Buddies for life. First time driving a tractor. It was on their place, an old 4010. I was trying to figure out how to shift it, stuff like that. You know, 10, 11 years old. Of course, we got caught by his dad and got her butt in trouble for driving the tractor around the yard. There has been times I've uh, come out and run a combine if he has to run to town or something comes up. If we need to jump into a combine sometimes, we have done that. There's been several times that 21st Century has went above and beyond. For instance, last year we had a combine go down and they scrambled to get one for us to use wires was being fixed. And we had a seal go out of, the, out of a gear case that wasn't a five minute job. We rounded up a combine to bring out so we can continue on. And Without a combine, we would have got behind at harvest. And when it's harvest time, you gotta run and get stuff out. Neil's brought a combine out before. He's, yeah, I think he's done that several times. Brought machinery out when we've had trouble. It's just kind of like you're working with your with your friends. You, you know everybody, it's a small town. Technology has made our operation much more efficient. Can run longer hours without fatigue because of auto steer. And then we can make smart decisions about chemicals and fertilizer applications through the yield maps. The technology side of it, we did introduce last year in the AutoPath. It makes it a lot easier to not have to count rows. RTK is pretty flawless. I would, I would say it probably it truly is sub-inch accuracy now. Auto path, like Neil was saying. We have machine sync on the combines and the cart trackers, it works really great. I was reluctant to get auto track. After we got auto track, we be, became so dependent on it. If we, you, get, you get fatigued after a couple hours of steering the tractor, it was incredible. My uh, son, this spring, will uh, come back from the Army. Mark's oldest boy is going to be coming back from the Army. He plans on hitting the ground running. Really happy that he wants this lifestyle. And uh, he, miss, he wants the farm. There, I mean, there's trials and tribulations. It's not always easy. But it's uh, nice just being kind of connected with Mother Earth, if you want to say, and planting something and watching it grow through the summer. and. Harvesting a great crop is very satisfying. I'm a third generation of uh, the Kimmel's farming, and so I'm excited to get the fourth generation involved.